Hey folks, this is Tim, aka Turbo BB. Uh, today I will be redoing the output measurement on the TN30 as previously in the um, former video I thought that it was approximately about 150 lumens over. So as such, um, I've actually recalibrated the sensor with the Xeno G10 V2 on high. Um, this normally puts out about 480 but I'm opting to err on the side of uh, being conservative by uh, calibrating at around 466-65 lumens. So, um, this light has been running for a while to stabilize the output because initially it is a little bit higher than this. So, with that said, we're going to take this off, get the logging started. Okay, get the TN30 into position. And we're going to go ahead and start monitoring. Okay, as you may have noticed, there was a um, soft ramp up at startup. Now this was um, intentional by design. And as you can see, it started over 3,100 approximately, um, which I believe you know matches through nice claim of max 3,000 lumens, even though they did not stipulate um, at what point that max was taken. One would just have to assume it's at startup, right? This light, as with the TN31, will step down approximately a minute. Um, into the runtime. However, it's pretty subtle. It's about 100 lumens, which you know my eyes cannot detect. Uh, with that said, though, unlike the TN31, it does not run fully regulated. It runs in semi-regulated mode for approximately 20 minutes or so before running into a gradual decline. But this will all be captured in my revised um, runtime chart, which I'll post to the TN30 review. So with that said, thank you very much for watching.